Hey guys, good morning. And good morning. Yes, that's a surprise. He wasn't expecting that. Mike can now chime in at will, whenever he likes. Uh, so today we're starting at the Waterloo Plain, which what? is Waterloo Plain Market, which is actually not that far away from the station. Waterloo Plain. Waterloo Plain. Behind us is the Moses and Aaron Church. Those of you. It's uh, very windy. Today. It is very windy. Yeah. So I think this adds something fun into the mix that Mike can now join the conversation. Very fun. Yes. Plus, it saves me a lot of translation work. Yeah. And I cannot corrupt anything Mike says because it's now coming from him directly. Yes. So, good morning, guys. Welcome. Good morning. It's another bike adventure. And we know there are a couple of you that enjoy this. We're going that to turn left here. Turn left. Wait, wait, wait. A little bit of no trams, no trams, no humans, no pedestrians, nothing. no cars, no animals, no chariots. And here are the bridges, and they're very steep. Those bridges are steep. Let's see if we can do it. We've been training for this. <laughs> we have good leg muscles that we call batteries. Very true. The second bridge is even steeper. We can do this. We're gonna own it. Own it. Own it, girl. Own it. By the way, guys, please allow me, as we're doing this bike adventure video, allow me to do a video within a video that I'm gonna be cutting out and also posting as a video in itself, which is... Sounds complicated. No, which is... Um, you know, the use of these microphones that we're now wearing, the microphones that give us the opportunity, you know, to have a conversation, me and Mike, between us, and that conversation ends up in one place on your um, recording device, and you don't have to mix anything. Um, and the microphone set that does this for us is, my God, I keep forgetting the name. GGI Mic. DJI Mix. Mick. DJI Mick. Yes. You're allowed to make fun of me. I dare to do, to, to do a review. And I don't even remember the name of what I'm reviewing. I know that sounds very dumb. I think we already reviewed them some yeah, time we, ago. We reviewed them, but not as a fun thing that you can add into the mix while biking together. Or better yet, while vlogging together, yeah. while biking together. Is that so? Yeah. So. I don't know, I think that's fun. It is. It's fun. And, um, and I like that Mike can now be heard also in the video. Yeah. I also like that. You like that? Yes. You like it. I like it. And now we like to move it. No. I also like that. You also like it. I it's so like funny, it. guys, to be walking here, uh, to be biking here in the area that we normally... Going to the left here. Go to the left. To the left, to the left, everybody. <laughs> to the left. Yeah? I'm actually not a Beyonce fan, so I don't know why I'm singing her song. Yeah, I don't I guess, know either. I guess it's just a fun song. It's just a song, honey. <laughs> just a song, honey. Yeah. Do you guys know that video wow. that Mike is referring to? He doesn't exist on YouTube anymore. There no. was this mother with her baby, and it was a newborn. She started singing a lullaby, and that kid got so emotional while looking and listening to his mom that he started tearing up and then crying. And the mom was like, I don't know what she said, like something like, are you emotional, honey? It's just a song. <laughs> it's just a song. If you guys know and what you've been saying it ever since. I've been saying it ever since the tease mic, whenever there was a, um, a chance to say it, to make that reference and be like, it's just a song. 
Yeah, and it's been for years. But I'm actually sad because I can't find that video. So if you guys happen to know what video I'm talking about, please share it in the comments. It's just a song, honey. It's a nice day. As you guys can see, it's beautiful. The sun is shining. But, there is a but. But. And um, some of you have forbidden me to use the word tropical. I always like to say it, just to make it clear that we're in summertime and we're having a storm. So I'm not going to use the tropical storm to make you happy. All you guys out there, they got upset. I'm not going to be happy over a tropical storm. No. So it's going to be a summer storm, it's, maybe, on the well, agenda today. You know, it's just going to rain. That's it. Yeah? No storm? No. I thought I read something about that. Something about stormy days. It's just going stormy to rain. Afternoon. It's just going to rain. Was it heavy rain? Heavy rain or not even that? No. No. Okay. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. So the point I was trying to make is that although it's now beautiful, they are expecting the weather to change a little bit. In the afternoon. In the afternoon. But first it's going to get warmer. Yeah. And it's not going to be that sunny. It's going to be cloudy. And then the temperature and the humidity are rising and then it ultimately will result in uh, thunderstorms and rain. So, just like the process you get with a tropical storm where the temperature first needs to build up, something like that we're going to get here this afternoon on a mini scale. <laughs> mm. Guys, there's something special about getting up early. I know I'm not a... Those of you that are not morning persons, I feel you 100%. I feel you. Yeah. I'm not a... <laughs> Listen to me talk, talking formal. So yes, I I'm see not a, you. I see you. So I'm not a morning person myself. No. But there is something about getting up early in the morning, especially when it's when the weather is nice, that will uh, change you. It will it will change your opinion. As soon as you're up and running, you'll be like, huh. I'm happy I did it actually. So Mike is a morning person. I used to be an evening person, but now I'm neither. You're not even sure you're a person anymore. I'm not even sure I'm a person. <laughs> I'm not even sure I'm a person. Everything changes so quickly. Yeah. Sign of the times. I'm Cousin It. I'm so, I, I've turned into something like Cousin It. Cousin That. Cousin It, Cousin That. So this, what you see on the right, guys, is the Amsterdam Architecture uh, School. They call it the Amsterdam School. Oh, the architectural style. Yeah. Yeah, it's from the 30s. It's beautiful it's and it gets nice. even better it gets even yeah. better but yeah this is nice we are just um, riding along the outskirts but if you um, go to the right into the neighborhood then it's very beautiful this is where mike this is mike's neighborhood this is yeah. mike mike's childhood yeah i grew up here he grew up here while i was chasing flamingos in north africa and this bridge on the left was used by the allies when liberating Amsterdam. So it's that one. Which allies? The Canadians or the... The Canadians. The Americans. The Canadians. The Canadians. I, we salute you, Canada. Canada, my Canada. We love that song. So, I was wondering, but there they are. Yeah, 
Yeah, we're going that way again, so. The Gonzales, Speedy Gonzales's. The Speedy Gonzales's. Yeah, so in the last video, where we told you guys in a segment, in a video where we told you that one of them was really rude, saying things like, hey, old man, hurry up. That was, they, they didn't say that to me, which make it, makes it even worse. They said that to an actual grandpa that was trying to get his car out of the driveway. So yes, they, they honestly can be really rude. Well, not of the, of the obviously, but. But maybe it's just a thing. I mean, recently we saw a guy doing that, exactly that kind of style, the speedy biking with his uh, girlfriend. And we, we, we saw him leaving her behind. Yeah. <laughs> we were actually shocked. Yeah, it was weird. Yeah. Well, we gone the exact same way as, uh, as those guys. So, okay. turn left here. Yeah, that was weird. He, he left her behind. It's like, huh? Huh? Man, why, why did you come together then? Gonna leave her behind anyway. I get the point. So it just goes to show you how serious they are about this. Very serious. Very serious. No fun at all. As we say, met that mess of tafel. Met that mess of tafel, yeah. Mm -hmm. It means put the knife on the table. It means it got grim. It and got very serious. It got very serious. Like the, the like life is on the line here. AKA the, the color of midlife crisis. <laughs> no, I think that's yellow. That's yellow? Yeah. Or was it red? Oh, red. I'm just joking. <laughs> the car is really cool. It's a cool car. Man, it's so nice. This breeze blowing in your face. Love yeah, it. It's extremely humid and um, yeah. Yeah. I almost had a heart attack. I saw the truck of our grocery shop and I was like, huh? Was ours scheduled today? <laughs> but no. It yeah. wasn't. It wasn't. It was, it, was, it was a different day. And the guy that came and delivered it, I always like to go downstairs and help them. And I always hope many will do, but they always tell me, no, sir, you're the only one that does come down and help us. Um, so I always like to chat a little bit. You know, they're not just two hands delivering groceries, they're humans. So I asked them, is your day going well so far? He said, actually, no at all. I said, why? He said, well, all those changes, all those blockades on the roads here in, in the city of Amsterdam make it almost impossible to deliver anything. So, yeah, we're a little bit divided here in Amsterdam lately because of the knip, which literally means the cut. The knip. The knip, one of the arteries here in Amsterdam, one of the busiest roads here in Amsterdam that goes right through the city center has now been uh, blocked. And it got to the point where even ambulance and police cars sometimes can continue their, um, their journey because of some formalities that need to be met first. So, yeah, so uh, he said, yeah, because of that, my work also got almost impossible to do. So we now have two groups. One group is like, no, it's good. It's good for nature, it's good. We need to get the smog out of the city in a way, now that we have smog in Amsterdam. Can you look at my uh, back tire? Yeah. See what it looks like. It looks good. It looks better. Okay. Yeah. So, guys, now that Mike brought that up, if you have fat tires, 
make sure that they always have um, enough air in there. Pressure. Hey, Mike, the cemetery is open, remember? Yeah, it's open. We yeah. showed it last time. Yeah. I think there's a ceremony going on. Uh, yeah. So what I was saying is if you have fat tires, make sure that the, the tire tension is always to the max. But don't overdo it. And like we showed you in a short video, which actually got a lot of views. Normally, the, um, the oh, amount of air that knows to, needs to go in there. Yeah, this is, this is amazing. This is, uh, this is <laughs> Yeah, we keep seeing it more and the more often. Perfect spot yeah. to uh, right in the answer that WhatsApp. It's crazy, it's amazing. Right <laughs> in the middle of the road. <laughs> Yeah, so what you need to know about your air tension, is that how we call it in English, is should actually air be... pressure. Pressure, yeah, pressure, that's the word. Should actually be written on the inside of your tire. So you don't have to guess how high it should be. So yeah, so we're divided right now. There's a group that says it's good for nature, that cut, you know, to keep cars away from the city center. But, and then there is another group which, you know, sounds, tries to, to sound realistic. And uh, they're like, but guys, we need to reach our homes. We need uh, to reach our- It's one of the major our, arteries of yeah, the city, so. We need to reach our homes. We need to reach our businesses. It's not just about leisure. It's also about people that need care, like medical care. So nurses can reach them so uh, ambulances that need to continue to go through police cars uh, uh, firefighters y you can't keep all the cars out of the city it's just not realistic but we have this council woman that just doesn't listen She's one of those persons that just listens to herself. Yeah, she likes to hear herself uh, yeah. talk. She acknowledges only what she sees. Yeah. So there are many arguments made for why she should keep the, because she's still calling it a pilot, why she should keep this pilot short. She just doesn't listen. And even when she tries to defend it, it's just BS that comes out of her mouth. If she stops it, it means failure on her uh, CV. Yeah. So. The ego wins. Yeah. It's crazy. Freaking politicians, right? Same everywhere. It's the same everywhere. Look at it, the ducks. Ah, uh, the ducks yeah. are the same everywhere too. Yeah. <laughs> All Duckies. the ducks in the world are the same. Duckies. Duckies. Ah, uh, look at that. You think, I, I keep thinking that we're early, but look, people are out and about fishing. It's really nice. Love it. Yeah. That guy sitting there. Yeah, I saw him. Yeah, he looked so happy, content, at least. So we got the windmill coming up. The windmill. The windmill. I always thought Holland would make a beautiful addition in Epcot if they would give us a pavilion. I mean, think about it. Just entering Epcot, looking over the water, that lake in the middle of Epcot, and then seeing a windmill on the other side. That is, that should be like a magnificent view. And as you, you uh, come closer... Want to get a shot of it? Yeah, let me get a shot of it. Let's let do get, that. Let me get a shot of it. Make your shot. There it is. There it is, guys. Do you see it? There it is. This is actually a windmill that even Rembrandt has painted it or sketched it. And there he is. There's Rembrandt. Not the real one. Not the real one, no. This is a bronze one. 
this Rembrandt kneeling down as to get a good uh, angle to sketch this. Yeah, there it is. It's nice. It's good to see tourists giving our, our culture some love. We're waiting for some cars, guys. So please stand by. All right. Yeah, those of you that have a good, good memory should we uh, should recognize this. We've been here. It was our first uh, tour. One of our first tours, yeah. Oh, the very first. Ah, look at all those tourists, guy, uh, Mike. They're loving our bike. They're all looking at our bike and smiling. Yeah, because you have the orange one. I'm the orange one. No, but your bike is getting some looks too. Ah, well. I'm 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 riding an orange. Straight ahead. Just go straight, straight ahead. Straight ahead. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to let you know when to turn. Uh huh. See, guys, because. We now have two-way communication. We have two ways of communicating. No, we, we have ha two-way communication. We have a two-way communication, yes, but we already had that, except it didn't end in the video. No, but now it does. But now it does. And how you can achieve that, guys, two-way communication, including one way that will make it into the video without having to do any additional editing. This is also nice. This is also amazing. It's amazing. I, I keep one... I, I, keep, I So... So we have Sena, which is um, a Bluetooth headset that you can use to talk to each other while biking. And now we have the DJI mic. For the iPhone. For the iPhone, yeah. yeah. So which I'm, we actually had for quite a long time, but we haven't. We haven't found a good use for it. No. Plus, we haven't been getting uh, out and about. For no, obvious. and it's you know you have to use it on the gimbal, and then you have two people that that can chime in on the audio. Yeah, yeah, and sometimes that can be inconvenient, a little bit, a little bit. But yeah, now, because then I can say stuff and which you don't like. Oh no, I was talking about you know have, uh, carrying an iPhone in your hand while one of these big pieces is sticking out, is mounted on it. But now it's just sitting here on the frame of my uh, bike and everything happens. By the way, this is the river Amstel. Yeah, this is the Amstel River. <laughs> yeah. So this is the river that uh, ultimately extends into Amsterdam and um, also provides all the canals with water. Is, is it also the river that provides the city with drinking water? No. no. Our drinking water comes from the coastal area. Wow. What are you doing? I'm, I'm You're cycling in the middle of the road. I'm trying to give this lady space. I'm trying to be gentleman, put myself in harm's way and keep her safe. I love how sometimes you come across these signs where it says, for example, here you can buy fresh eggs. Yeah. Love that. But you know, uh, I've not been here for quite a long time. I think uh, 15 years. It has changed a lot in those 15 years. There used to be more, far less homes here. And it's, uh, it's, it's like there's been an explosion of these homes that are built here. It used to be quite um, open, uh, open country or countryside. Yeah. But I see a lot of new houses and especially large houses being built here. Uh, very uh, expensive houses. Yeah, I guess at some point it became a thing to leave the city center. 
the bustle yeah, but and hustle. That, that, uh, what I meant to say is that it happened um, over the last couple of years. Yeah, rapidly, yeah. Yeah, but I must say, I get it why people want to be on this exact lane because I don't have um, I, I don't have a safe way to show you guys what I'm seeing on both sides, but it's really nice. But may, wait, wait, maybe I can do it like this. I'm now in the middle of the, ro of the road. Yeah, let me go back. So what yeah, there is this, this, there is this beautiful river with all kind of vegetation growing on both sides, and it just gives it this nice, relaxing, wild <clears throat> river ambience. And to be able to look out the window and to see that is, yeah, is, is really something. But Mike, some of these homes are also farms. I see farm-ish yeah, yeah, well, uh, business going on on the back, on some of them. On the other side of the water, you mean? No, 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 behind these, these homes on the right. No, I don't think these are uh, working farms. These are just mansions. Okay, but... Uh, maybe on the other maybe side of the water there's still some farms, but not on this side. No, I said not all of them, but some of them seem like they have some sort of sheds where they keep animals. Yeah, Whether it's uh, for business or just for their own, private. Could be. I mean, my grandma. Uh, had a couple of sheep and, and chickens, not for business purposes, but just because she she needed to keep herself busy. So I, I get that. Some people need that. That's a nice mini truck. We recently saw a video of this really nice fellow um, who had a mini truck shipped from China. You know, one of these mini cute, almost anime size trucks. And it looks so out of place in the US that some people were really surprised. Like, what is that? What is that? <laughs> what is that? Yeah, because you guys don't have, those of you that happen to be watching now from the US, you guys don't have, I don't think you have that concept yet or not that far, far spread of like mini, mini trucks and mini cars. But here in Holland, it's, yeah, all, it's all about how to be innovative and um, come out with ways to keep vehicles small lately. What really bugs me about that is that you still need to have a driving license which we don't have. And I'm like, if I'm going to go through the trouble of getting a driving license, I'm not gonna go for a small car. No? I'm gonna get a freaking Jeep. Oh, well. That's a good one to have in the center of Amsterdam. Yeah, chill, chill. I'm pedaling, but I'm not making you know, speed as normally I would. And I think it's really, it's because the, the wind that we're getting, pushing us back. And what uh, gear are you? Okay, I'm now going to four. Yeah. Nothing can stop me now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's a nice song. I'm still upset that Disney in Hollywood Studios, took down the movie ride and replaced it with this Mickey Mouse ride. But the song is kind of cute. I do kind of like the song. So guys, those of you that love this area and want to see more of it, please go back a couple of uh, adventures. 
because we did in one of the first adventures that we did we stopped and we showed you more of this area we showed you the buildings we told you a little bit of the history so that's why we're biking through it right now the way we're doing right now man it's so nice along the water so we need nice. to uh, cross the bridge here cross the bridge in order to prevent uh, taking some ferry so okay yeah uh, so we need to go to the right and then up yeah. the bridge yeah I, I think you need to ride around a bit yeah but yeah I mean that's so yeah so to the right and then up the hill maybe yeah yeah oh, yeah. yeah okay no that's a dead end yeah I get it I see it I see it so we need to cross and then oh this is uh, almost complete the construction here yeah and then I think this is how we get on the bridge yes yeah 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 This is it. Yeah, it looks all new. Last time me and Mike were here, this was still under construction. We, we couldn't even get on it and it was really inconvenient. And it was okay. such, yeah? So we need, to, we need ultimately to go to the left, but that means, uh, uh, to the right, sorry, but that means go to the left first. Yeah. And then take and a U-turn, yeah. The, um, I see it. No, no, no. To the left, he said. Yeah. Well, oh, we can just continue here. Um, now, we need to go that way. No, I don't think there is a way. Uh, oh, here, here, under the bridge. Ah, okay. Yeah. Yes. Sometimes it's a bit hard to read the yeah. GPS. Yeah, but yeah. Because it's so zoomed in. True, and then you have these openings on the bridges that are some, sometimes tucked in. And you can miss them easily. So you always need to look around. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, this is nice to be on this level. It's great. The level of the water itself. You see more of the river. Everyone. Looks like most people are still sleeping. The church is closed. So, so just yeah. straight ahead here. We're now... We're now going to like a neighborhood. I don't know, it looks familiar. No, we've not been here. It, we haven't been here? Not no. The last time that we were here? No. Okay, so it's just straight ahead? Uh, yes. Plus, plus is a supermarket. supermarket chain that we have here. But it's been a while since I've seen one. Look at that, how cute is this guy? It's, I mean, when I was a teenager, sometimes I would go with mom to these kind of little shops when she wanted to shop for a dress or something. Always hot. hot like a huge drugstore with everything if you need anything in the drugstore area and you see crowdfot then that's the place to go usually okay, we need to turn right here turn right okay so I'm gonna stick my right hand out indicate that man those bikers are everywhere yeah. Mmm, I smell fish. Wow. They're already trying. Oh, this is nice. Poffertjes. It's another Dutch. Uh, Do you want uh, kibbling? Kibbling. Poffertjes salon. I think we're going to, re to be returning here. Yeah. On our way back. This is oh, nice. Look at this huge church. You see yeah. that one? This church right here. Uh, no, that one. 
This is also a big church. It's funny, two churches next to each other. Yeah, that yeah, one is called the church street. <laughs> really? Yeah. I was just zigzagging all the way because I wanted to show you guys the puffages. It's a Dutch treat. It's really good. It's like puffed pancakes. It's really good with jam. But then I didn't saw this guy coming with his car and he, he was about to stick his head out the window to say something. I already said, I'm sorry, my bad. And he said, thank you. So sometimes people appreciate it. Or you just acknowledge that it's your fault. Yeah, this is a huge church. It's not often that I see these, these kind of huge churches here in Holland. It's a really big complex. Maybe it's a Catholic church with their own uh, convent. Wouldn't surprise me. It is big. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's nice, it's beautiful. Wait. It's nice. There is this village vibe here. Okay, turn right here. That's right, yes. I'm sticking my arms up. So this is clearly a neighborhood with kids, as is being indicated a couple of times. So just mind your speed, guys, when you see that. Because kids and animals are really unpredictable. So your eyes must be at 100% working. Yeah, see there's one. There's a kid. So we're now riding alongside the water again. Ah, uh, he, he wants to play on his trampoline. Yeah, me too. You too? Yeah. I didn't know you had a trampoline. I don't, but I, I, I still want it. Yeah, <laughs> I would love one too. It's actually very healthy to jump on the trampoline. It's supposed to be like a complete workout. Okay, so this is the Amstel again. Yeah, beautiful. Look, those cigar-shaped thingies on those plants. You know what they remind me of, Mike? No. As a Disney fan, as a Disney animation? The old meal. The old meal, yes. You see them bre breaking in the wind. Yeah. And, and you see those birds being afraid and cuddling up. Which is also can be used when we have the Holland Pavilion in Epcot, that, that can be part of the theming. Well, the they old should meal. have asked you to do the aesthetics. Yes, honestly, if you happen to have connection within Disney, and Disney can use some, a little success story right now, please refer them to me. I'm gonna design a Holland Pavilion, and it's gonna be the most beautiful one. And I'm going to also add like a workshop where you guys can come and make your own wooden shoes. Yeah, and then there's a wooden shoe ride where a you can ride wooden shoes. Yes, in a, so instead of a boat, you now sit in a, wooden sh a boat that's shaped like a wooden shoe. And does it go upside down? No, but it does go up somehow. I need to find something, some theming. Uh, so it's going to be like a big meal and you guys are in that meal about to get grinded. That's nice. So, so it's going to be some sort of a thrill ride. Sounds great. But then you're not going to end up being grinded because this Dutch farmer comes and saves the day somehow. Well, <laughs> sounds very thrilling. No, it went down. 
It went south. No, no, I'm gonna come up with a better design, better backstory, where gr being grinded is not involved. But seriously, Holland as a theming for the pavilion in Epcot has a lot of potentials. There is a lot that you can do with that. See the potential. Yeah. Think about the tulip season. Who doesn't love tulips? Well, you know, I think if my memory serves right, Holland used to be part of the original countries that signed up to be there. But yeah, and then it fell off the race. It, it didn't uh, go over. So I think that maybe because countries were asked to bump money into to the, contribute, into it themselves. yeah. So a lot of them said, well, you know, no. No, <laughs> because it's just some theme park. Well, I know that the, the previous generation thought differently about theme parks. It's just something where crazy, silly people go. But uh, now we know what theme parks can do. I mean, look at Disney. It's one of the most powerful entities in the US. So I think people are now changing their opinion. But yeah, think about King's Day. When we celebrate King's Day, you guys get to celebrate that in that pavilion. Big party. Food, drinks, dance, games, Dutch games that family used to play together. Yeah, really, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm serious. I'm really upset that Holland, um, you know, is not even considered as a candidate. You're, you guys are missing out. I mean, and there can be a workshop where you can make your own wooden shoes and also a workshop where you can make your own cheese or at least see the process of how that's being made. Isn't that what Epcot used to be about, the educational aspect? Edutainment. It yeah. went from education to entertainment. No, it went from edutainment to, to entertainment and especially to drinking. Especially to drinking, yeah, it's now all about drinking. And I mean, it's beautiful. Yeah, it's really nice. It's nice. So many water lilies. It's another thing that I realized about our own country. The waters here in Holland are full with water lilies. Water lilies. My battery is already beginning to die. So. No. Yeah. But then you're carrying extra weight today. We yeah, have our and, extra and batteries. You know, it, it, may, it may, might not look like it, but there's a lot of wind. Yeah, no, there is, there is. It's a good thing we have these uh, dead cats on our uh, microphones. Yeah, true. <laughs> yes, because we already did the test. And seriously, guys, these dead cats on the microphones make a huge difference. Mike's voice was crisp, loud and clear. I'm always crisp. You're always crisp. Man, that's crisp. Yeah, L like a crisp uh. burger from... Ah, uh, there, there is a sheep that's leaning against the lower part of the trunk of a tree like a human would do and just fell asleep. That's really touching. Look at that, beautiful to have this as your backyard. Man, I'm jealous. Yeah. Yeah. I love that. I love country. I love country. I mean, I, ha I, I didn't grow up as a country boy, but I grew up as a country-ish boy between country city... Country girl. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Because a country girl knows her ways. I grew up between what would be considered as between a village and a city, something like that, but not really country. But I do love country, like the hardcore country like this. Ah, uh, yeah. uh, yes. Duckies. Duckies. Ducky, ducky. Yeah, I love it, I love it. But oh, so yeah, oh, oh, oh. I'll, I'll, I'll look at him or her speeding. Yeah. That is crazy, it's lady. Her. See, this is why ladies are a threat on the road. 
I'm yeah. joking. No, I'm Is joking. So? I'm joking. Going to make a lot of friends with I'm that. I'm going to make. No, 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 no. Listen, Bruce, In you fact, can only think that. You cannot say that anymore. Yeah. Did I say that out loud? <laughs> Use your inner voice. <laughs> Did I say that out loud? <laughs> no, that was really a, a conscious joke. I was conscious of what I say. But um, yeah, but that lady can be doing that, really. Not on a world like ah, this. You know, I think she, she was born here, grew up here. And knows she's the road living like on the, the edge. Back, the back of her head. She's one of those girls that lives on the edge. I love it. One of these speed devil grandmas. I think she was our age. She was, but <laughs> no, she was, she was completely white, white hair. Yeah. Luckily, we don't have any. Well, we have magic. <laughs> we magic, have magic. That magic we... eraser. <laughs> <laughs> we have white, white hair eraser magic. We just put it on our hair and bibbidi babbidi boop. It's gone. It's gone and we're young and lush again. Yeah. I wonder how that will last, how long that will last. I don't know. I changed to a new formula, formula recently, so. Mm. Oh man, Mike, can you uh, uh, smell that? Burning wood? Burning wood. Oh guys, this is the, this is, this is the pinnacle. Oh man, I love it. I mean, when you talk about countryside, burning wood. Burning wood. The smell of burning wood is, is the pinnacle, the highlight. Hey, what something's going on, Mike. Camping. Oh, it's a camping ground. Okay. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. I need to give you guys a shot of this. You got to stop. Yeah, just for a little bit. Just for a little bit. I'm, I'm behind you. I'm continuing because you're breaking up. Ah, uh, sheep. I mean, imagine that, setting up your tent between sheeps. Sheep, not sheeps, between sheep. That was really nice. That was a really nice special camping ground. Yeah, it was uh, beautiful. A little break there to adjust and readjust. You guys know how that goes? Checking the audio. Checking See the audio. If, if all went well. Yeah, it's it's really, really good. I hope nothing will change and that you guys will end up seeing the video as we just uh, checked it and everything seems perfect. The audio, the mixing of me and Mike in there, both both voices crisp, clear. Yeah. Mm, and now we're smelling that typical farm smell. Oh yeah. We did again. This is the ferry that wasn't working last time and isn't working now. Yeah. Oh, we all look alike. No, I'm sorry. I, I meant to say, I, I thought that I was the, the one of the previous ones that we had to get on, but we couldn't because we didn't have small changes, uh, small pocket money. But now, this is not the same one because I don't think we did this route before. Did we? I need to catch up with Mike because he's breaking up. Yeah. All right. We're back. This is gorgeous. I will never get tired of this. Cows. I'll never get tired of this. I love, 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 love this. Biking along the river with prairie on the left, cows, little farms, and then city line. 
all the way in the back it's gorgeous and then the smells guys it's it's all about the smells the flowers the manure the cows there's no show business like this nature is showing itself in 3d actually in 4d we also get smell love it see before I did this with Mike the, these bike adventures if you were to ask me what to do when you come to Holland I would say I don't know visit Amsterdam visit this do that you know the standard things which are also really nice to do but now in addition to that I would also say please rent a bike and go bike around It's almost spiritual. Love it. Yeah, it's nice. It's really nice. Look at that huge church here yeah. again. Yeah, speaking about spiritual. It's, um, it looks like the Prague church. Yeah, it's beautiful. Wow, Mike, didn't even know we had this kind of style. No, we neither. It's really, really beautiful. I'm going to ste step, I'm going to stop here a little yeah. bit, otherwise I won't be able to get this shot. Yeah, stop here, but what? because it's very narrow here. Look at that. Can you guys see it? It's gorgeous. It really is gorgeous. Look, and then there is St. Joseph's School next to it. The St. Joseph School. I wonder what, what kind of school it was. Because as you guys might or might not know, Christian countries were actually like what you see in Islamic countries today, separate. Boys and girls were not allowed to be in the same building. So it's always nice to know what kind of history one of the, like, for example, this incident that school had. Well, what? I'm going to look it up. Yeah? Yeah. Was it a boys' school, girls' school? No. I'm still oh. looking for it. We're now in a, in a little town called Ness aan de Amstel. Oh, my, my instinct was to repeat what Mike just said, <laughs> but I still need to keep reminding myself, and I've been doing that the whole morning, that I. There is no need for me to repeat what he's saying because you guys are hearing him directly. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's not on the map. It's not on the map? St. Joseph's School? <laughs> My voice oh. just broke up. Yeah? yeah. St. Joseph's ah. School! Ah. <laughs> Sounds like... Okay, but I, I'm looking at Apple Maps and it's, it's not... Sh I, I can see the building, but it's not saying what it is. Um, but what, what if you look up St. Joseph's School? It's nice. I mean, imagine this. Go, in, go back in time in your own imaginary. And imagine this as a Dutch village. Like around 15, the year of 1500 or 1600. 1700 maybe even. Very conservative. With a boys' school a big church, a couple of simple homes here, mostly farms. No, I, I can't find anything. That's weird. It's a cover-up. <laughs> <laughs> we, got, we got our first conspiracy. About 1,200 people live here. Huh? Look at that balcony of that church. No, can't find anything, sorry. I want to stand there but and, it's, and uh, sing. Epic. Huh? It's an epic building. It's really beautiful. Yes, Mike. Mike just said, I don't know if you guys catch that because I was babbling. Caught that. Mike said, it looks like the churches we saw in Prague. We went to Prague. Beautiful yeah, or city. Harry Potter. Yeah, or Harry Potter, yeah. <laughs> yes, honestly. Yes. Oh, look, oh. it's chiming. It's chiming for us and it's not even, what is it? It's 10, 10 o'clock. <coughs> Listen. Yeah. 
Yeah. That's nice. That's nice. Look, a lawn mower. One of these automatic lawn mowers. Huh? I was Where? like, a, I was like, who's this kid that that that's doing that remote control car? Oh, yeah. here. <laughs> but it's a, a mower. <laughs> it's a Roomba for your grass. Yeah, and it's shaped like um, a Formula One car. <laughs> love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. <laughs> Look at that, guys. Can you guys see it? <laughs> That's great. That's really, that's really nice. That's really funny. Man, I love these e-bikes, but man, are they heavy. these haystacks yes yes can, um, lower and raise the, the yeah roof. yeah 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 the less there is the lower <laughs> yeah and it's really needed here in Holland because for the rain sunny days are really limited well sometimes but then sometimes we have summers well the heat wave just continues on and on for months on end weeks well I don't know last summer it, it was not weeks it was a couple of months Wow that cow manure sometimes can be really strong <laughs> yeah it hits you and you're like whoa I can't breathe it uh, slaps you across the face yeah it slaps you Left and right. The only thing that makes me sad is that I never see this cozy farmer family as I have them pictured <coughs> in my mind. <coughs> I never see them outside the way that I've pictured them. Look at these cows. Yes, look at these cows. So You're many. Having a meeting. The gathering of the cows. They're about to take over the world. Ah, cows are so sweet. Look out. Oh, I see a perfect spot for yes, our... Yes, 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 yes. We're going to sit here and enjoy the cows and enjoy on bite cook. <coughs> oh, look. You can either face the water side or the cow. Yeah, how about that, guys? That's nice. <laughs> That's really nice, yeah. Look at that. You can either face the cows and the manure or face the water and the fishes. What it says here, these, cow, these uh, seats were made possible by the funds of the, sell, the, the selling of the book that's called at the Plug Book van Bo de Brands. Sick a plug. A collection of 30 years news facts. That's a sick plug. From this uh, this village, yeah, that's a sick plug. Ah, yes, <laughs> that's nice. Sick plug. Wait, wait, wait! I want to go there and then give you an overview of where we're sitting. So there's also this bench right there. Also this bench, guys. It's so beautiful here. It's really beautiful. And then we're oh, I see a guy sitting there. What is he doing with his hands? Where? Oh, on the other side. <laughs> No, I thought he was doing something not decent, but he's actually reeling in his fish. So me and Mike are going to sit there. Oh, today's uh, bottle, uh, water of bottle contains slices of citrus, lemon, uh, nectarine, and pineapple. So today I went with vitamin C overload. That's a tropical mix. Tropical mix, yeah. So finally, something that I can rightfully referred to as tropical. You have to unbite cook in your bag, so. All right. So guys, we're gonna sit here. See you in a bit. This is our moment. I don't want you. We don't wanna bore you. <laughs> we're just gonna sit here like two grandpas. All right, see you in a bit, guys. Time for unbite cook. 
And by now, by now, you guys must know what that is. And otherwise, why haven't you been watching these videos if you don't know what this is? Mike, I cannot find on Bad Cook. Are what? you sure it's here? No. No, you Let have Let me them. double check. Do I have them? I, I don't have share it. them in the video, but I can't. Oh, yeah. You have them? Yeah. So if you don't know what old bag cook is, Almost it's this. Almost gave me a heart attack. Me too. It's like this, it's, it's this cookie. Snella yellow. Typical Dutch. Two, two euros for four. These are big, look thick. Perfect snack cookie. to have on you. Huh? It's just a cookie. It's just a cookie. Well, it's, yeah, again, this is, um, Multi-use cookie, you can have it as a cookie or smear, whatever on it. Look, and Schiphol Airport is over there. Oh, no, I can't show you. I cannot show you. <laughs> but there is, a, there is an, over, uh, uh, an airplane flying overhead. All right, see you guys in a bit. Guys, uh, I haven't been doing this for the longest time, so I forgot about that. But if you want a flavor enhancer when you put uh, pieces of fruit in your bottle of water, if you want something that will really bring out all those flavors and just have it absorbed in, into your water, you have to add a couple slices of citrus. They're so good. And now I'm gonna introduce you guys to our girlfriend right there that's been eyeballing us. But I'm gonna do it from a distance because I don't wanna bother her. She's so cute. No. She's so cute. Look at that. <laughs> She's really cute. Her eyes got bigger. No, I don't want to scare her. <laughs> She's so cute. Look at that mouth. Oh, they're so sweet. Animals are so sweet. You always hope that they're happy when you look at animals. Some animals have this look in their eyes. So peaceful. Sweeties. Not gonna bother her anymore. But it's a pleasure to have you in the video. Those fishermen talking to each other. I think they have those earpieces that we have too to communicate with each other. <laughs> it was recording. Now it's recording. Story Go. Story of my life. Yeah, Mike already shared the whole story of his life with you guys, but I wasn't recording. Yeah. I had to stop him right there. So you're here? Yeah. Let's move. Do you hear what I hear? Yeah, next year. <laughs> next year. No, it's actually this year. Yeah. We, we get, actually, a lot of people are already getting ready for Halloween. But I don't. I don't. I'm still um, in the You're still in the summer. summer. Yeah, of course. Of course, guys, enjoy the moment. Some people are already in the Halloween phase. Oh, look, that's... Um, bunker here as well oh yeah oh yeah huge bunker yeah it looks like hardcore military yeah I love it I love bunkers love the way they look yeah yeah there's something about them bonkers <laughs> isn't that an expression of slang in the US So these people asked us like half hour ago, but they're still here. Only yeah, a couple, well, of, couple of minutes away from us where they passed us. They want us to sit on that little couch as well. Maybe. They're like, finally, those guys left. 
It's like the rocking chair at Magic Kingdom where people wait on you to have their turn. What's the guy doing on the bridge? Oh, you can do it yourself? I don't think so. I don't think so. Yeah. But then again, there's nobody that's guarding the bridge, so maybe you are supposed to. Turkish flag? Yes, it is a Turkish flag. I don't get it, but they're all Dutch kids. I mean, like, why Dutch kids? <laughs> well, we're all Dutch kids, but you know, you guys know what I mean. I'm sure I have, I have, how do you say that? Broke many political correct rules right now, but you guys know what I mean. I mean no harm. I mean like they're like Dutch Dutch kids. Why would they have a Turkish flag on their boat? What a wind, what a wind. Yeah, your voice is breaking up because of the wind. But that's on my headset. I hope the DJI uh, mic doesn't have problems with mic. Get it? I'm smelling cows again. Those grandpas are giving Mike the look. Yeah. I had to speed up. To pass them. Yeah, plus the other guy was coming at me, so I went with a past hammer? him like crazy, huh? Did he came at you with a hammer? He came at me with a hammer, yeah. You not in sections. in sections. Not in sections. Ah, a little more, mouth on the road. More curves like a scenic railroad. We love that saying by um, Fred Astaire. Fred Astaire, yeah. About Sid Cherise. He was talking about the curves of a lady. She came at me in sections. <laughs> <laughs> Who come up with that? It's really too good, too funny. came at me in sections. More curves than the scenic routes. This is really nice. Yeah, it's nice. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. I am so relieved that we still have this much nature in Holland. And a good thing, there's a good thing, European Union only this week decided that uh, wherever there is left of nature in Europe, Western Europe, from this point must be protected. So, which means if it all goes correct as it should be, we shouldn't be losing more nature. We should keep as it is right now, at least. But we'll see how that pans we'll out. We'll see how that, that's why I'm reluctant. Yeah, that's why I'm saying if everything goes well, because politicians, they promise you a lot and they give you nothing. Because at some point, at some point as a country, you have to, to stand your ground and say enough. A country needs its eco, uh, ecosystem. And nature is what makes a system an ecosystem. So you cannot just keep building and building for the sake of profit and business and industry. It's just, it's not how it goes. It's crazy. It's, slow suicide so yeah i'm really happy that they did that in europe
there is, there's, there is a need for balance. Because some people tend to see these prairies and they'd be like, oh, but there is still enough space in Holland, we can still continue building. No. This is the balance you need to keep your hands off. I am really happy and proud that we have this. Wafer. Waver. So I'm gonna wave. I'm not waving. As, enter, as I am entering the village of Wafer. Look at that. Washing on the line. <laughs> Clothes. Classic. It's classic. Oh wow, we have a mailbox here where you can drop your letters. People still do that? That is really cute. Wow, the edge of the road is pretty high here, so I yeah. you must be careful not to be too close with your tire. You can slip off. Oh, this is very narrow. Yeah, but it's nice. It makes, oh look, ducks and chickens and stuff. <laughs> look at these people having breakfast. Two grandpas, I think the grandpas of both families, hers and his. Oh, Mike, what? see? Yes. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that was bound to happen. I'm, I'm surprised it didn't happen to me. No, I saw it too late. Yeah. Luckily for the thick tires. Luckily we have thick tires. Yeah. No, but seriously, that is that uh, you can easily miss it. You and can easily overlook it. It's very narrow. Yeah. But it's also abrupt. Yeah. I mean, look at these edges. It's not like they're uh, flattening in, how do you say that? Gradually, no, it's just. Yeah, you know, that's, that's probably because over the years, there have been another layer and another layer of yes, asphalt. Added. Yes, yes, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you can tell. Yeah. You can tell. Yeah. I mean, it's not dangerous. You just have to focus a little bit. I love, this I love that nice. even the benches they have here for you to sit on, you know, public benches, they're not like those industrial benches they will find in the city. They're all those cute wooden benches they have here. Yeah. So it's just, oh wow, look, I almost did what Mike did. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh, look at this, this, this home on the corner here. Uh, no, the other side. So old and roses. It's all very nice. Yeah, oh, this is beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Let's gorgeous. slow down a little bit. Yeah, I am trying to slow down. It's beautiful. To take beautiful. it all in. Yeah. I'm actually thankful that these people exist here because because they're a little bit wealthy. They can build. Oh, look at that! The whole barn is collapsing in. Yeah. Wow! It must be an old barn. So charming. Love it. Whoa. So yeah, happy that they're here. They have their wealth building this. Now we can all enjoy it. Look, even more sheep leaning against tree trunks and falling asleep. Which is weird because I wouldn't say it's really that hot today. Wow. Yeah, no, it's beautiful weather, but I mean, I wouldn't say that it's that hot that you almost pass out. That no. kind of heat, we, we did have that a couple On of days. On my birthday. On your birthday, yeah. Yeah, that was uh, that was a good excuse. We had a intense. Yeah, but then we had the best ice cream I've had in years. That's true. 
next to the homemade ice cream that we've started making. If you guys haven't seen that, sick plug, check out our homemade ice cream videos. Uh, uh, yeah, really nice homes here. Look, I added a little piece of asphalt. Yes, Alongside yeah, to compensate. To yes, yeah, yeah, <laughs> see? To compensate for the, the problem we just Encounters. pointed out, yeah. Oh, this one is building a new barn. Nice. Yeah, it's nice. Reminds me of seven brothers and seven brides. Yeah. Yeah, because that's the only time that I see someone building a barn. I've never seen it in real life. Well, up till today. Well, what do you know? What do you know? What do you know? Learn something new every day. Yeah. As my grandma used to say, as long as you're still alive, you'll keep seeing new things every day. True. So, some vegetation already is dead and dry, and but then most of it is still green and lush. But this is very close to the water side. Yeah, okay. On the yeah, right yeah. hand side. Yeah. This is only mm. this piece of grass and then it's water. Yeah, what's, what is it called? Reet. What's reet called in English, Mike? Reet. 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 I, I forgot. I forgot the word for it, the English word. Reet. 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 Mm. Man, this is so gorgeous. This is so relaxing. Reet. This is so relaxing, guys. I wish you could feel the breeze through your TV or your screen. Or your phone. Or your phone, yeah. It's so nice. This nice sun, you know, on your skin. And then, despite that, there is also this breeze that balances it all out. It's just perfect. Pure happiness and bliss. happiness that does not cost you a penny. Oh, look at that, Jaws. Yeah. His boat is Jaws. His boat was called Irreplaceable. <laughs> Lovely confidence. So is the boat irreplaceable or is he? Both, I think. Both. I think so too. I'm hearing chickens and roosts, roosters, roosters roosting. Roosters roosting. Not roasting, but roosting. Uh, I love it. I love these kind of homes that have these little bridges. Yeah. That lead you to their entrance. It's nice. Someone is a heavy smoker. I think the guy from the car yeah. I keep smelling cigarettes. Kept I smell kept smelling cigarettes. You can already make out Amsterdam. Yes. In the distance. That's exactly what I just thought. You can already see the city center. Or the city at least. I think the first time for me to ever see a fro completely frozen river was in Amsterdam. It was in a landscape much like this one. Not far from here, I think. 
Yeah, it was beautiful. And to me, I grew up in North Africa where we had cold and hail and all that, but definitely never had a river that completely froze over. And certainly not rivers that were that frozen that you can actually walk on them miles and miles on end. So that, um, that's really a special memory attached to Amsterdam in my, my mind, my memories. Some people just don't bother to take down the Christmas uh, decoration. No. It's almost Christmas again. It's almost Christmas again, yeah. And then there is those people that say that they just cannot part with it. This makes them happy. They can't part with it. But then again, if you... Oh, oh there. They're selling fresh eggs. Eggs are getting expensive in Holland, guys. Seriously. So maybe we should look into this. Oh, radish and uh, not pumpkin, but courgette. This farm sells radish and courgette. Whoa. Wind is picking up again. The wind, yeah. So since today, um, Tricky weather-wise, we decided not not to go too far, not to wander too far off, just in case the weather starts to get bad. That um, that that we'll we'll be able to reach home in relatively short time. Oh, that's a nice cafe. So peaceful. Yeah, it's nice. Looks like a home that's converted into a cafe. Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. I'm looking at a plane in the distance and it looks like it's just gliding on the on the left. Can you see Mike? It's white. Oh, now it disappeared. Because it's not reflecting light anymore. It it now it's now how do you say that? tip to the other side it looked really weird like a big bird a white big bird wow yeah it's extremely windy i can yeah. feel uh, the wind yes. pulling on the bike yeah me too yeah it's really windy you can feel it pushing you a little bit So nice out here. That's yeah, why it I'm, is. yeah. Just makes you quiet. Just makes you want to be quiet and look around. Sheep. Oh man, sheep manure is really strong. That's a huge willow tree. Wow. Are those solar panels, Mike, along the road? That's smart. I didn't see it. 
Here, in front of you. Ahead. Ahead, up, up on the road. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. I think they are, yeah. Part of the um, sound walls. I just love how here in Holland, you are warned, like very specific. Like now, well, before we enter this piece, they're like, seek eye contact, don't zoom before you cross over. Because there's so many things going on. They don't want you to assume that you've, you've been seen or... So then you get signs that actually say that. Seek visual confirmation and eye contact. And then they draw this, this line from a car to, your, to the eyes of that figure. <laughs> I love it. Hey, that's a nice van. Yeah. Speaking of citrus, looks like a big citrus on wheels. Looks like mm -hmm. a big lemon. Lemon, yeah, I love it. Love it, yeah, really nice van. Whoa, 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 whoa. What, what, what? Huh? Wow, that's a really narrow path for the Another bike. group of those guys And those coming. obnoxious guys are coming up. But thank God we're not on the same side. Oh, wow, wow. It's like Tour de France. There's a lot of them. They're all training. Hmm. All of them together smell like candy almond. Yeah? <laughs> For some weird reason. Candy Maybe apples. Yeah. Candied almonds. Okay, Shop, uh, so maybe now it's over the bridge. Yeah, I think it's called sugar-coated almonds and peanuts. Man, I'm crazy about those. Just watching my sugar intake, but I'm actually crazy about sugar-coated almonds and peanuts. And then turn right here. Dougie. Oh wow, Mike, look at this mansion. Yeah. Wow. Beautiful mansion in every meaning of the word. Wow. Yeah. Wow. I love it. Wow. Honestly, one of the best looking mansions I've seen in, in a long time. It's, it's built in the old style. Yeah, almost colonial. Yeah? Yeah, but then it's gray. It's not it's brown. Gray. Or green. It doesn't Earl, have green. Earl gray. Earl gray, yeah. Earl gray. Okay. We passed. Uh, we passed a point we, where yeah. we had to take a yeah. turn? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah, yeah. All right. Let's stand here. Enjoy this. Wah, wah, wah. Yeah, I see it. She, she loved the picture Alberto took. Yeah. It was very neat. It was really nice. Alberto took a good picture. We used to have um, a children programming here in Holland. Actually, it was Belgian, but it was also broadcasted here in Holland. And uh, it was this guy with his talking dog, and then he had, he had a mayor and a hairdresser. And that guy was called Alberto. That's what this reminded me of. So he was Belgian, but he was called Alberto, which is usually Italian. So people always assumed that he was just an Albert. So he would, they would call them, hey, Albert. And he's like, no, 
It's Alberto. And he would yell like that. Look at these little bike paths. They're so cute. Stop for an ice cream or something today? No, because there we, we, we didn't encounter uh, anything. Yeah. Maybe uh, later on. True. And if not, we still have enough ice cream at home. We made tons of ice cream, but uh, we don't have any cheeseburgers at home. We don't have cheeseburgers, man. <laughs> we're getting actually uh, we're making Caesar salad nice grilled chicken mm. oh well in that case we can have a nice hearty lunch yeah yeah to compensate that because we're allowed yeah yeah I still have around 800 calories Wow yes Wow I mean, I already um, registered my breakfast, then the Caesar salad, and I'm... Wow. I know. So, I guess, yes, we can do a cheeseburger. Oh, well, then we'll just have to find a cheeseburger place. Cheeseburger. A hamburger. Hamburger. Oh, let's see, turn. I wish I could taste Bob's burger burger. <laughs> that guy seems so sweet and genuine in his burgers that I want to taste them. Whoa. Ah, whoa. <laughs> there was a pothole. A pothole? Pothole. <laughs> Look, and I think that's the hospital. Over there. That's uh, Burger King. That's the hospital, and alongside it is the Burger King. But mm. I'm not sure if we can get there from here. We must. We must march on to Burger King. We can give it a try. We shall not give up. I recognize that strange tower with the Swiss cheese thingy. Ow. I'm gonna go for the Whopper. Yeah? I'm gonna whop it. Man, whop look it. at me, I'm pumped. I saw Burger King. <laughs> I saw Burger King and all of a sudden God gave me more boost. Look, it's not like I'm uh, increasing my speed to get there. No, you're not. It just no. happens. Yeah, it's organically. I, I'm, I'm naturally drawn to it. It's, look. it's the magnetism is stronger around here. Look, I, I don't even have to pedal. Wow, See? look at that. <laughs> it's just pure magnetism. The magnetism is really pulling Mike. He's not even pedaling. <laughs> look, and I'm, I'm still increasing speed. Wow, it's the mothership. <laughs> We're being beamed on board. Let's see what we have. It's been a while since I had a Whopper. We really um, don't do that often, uh, junk we food. We first so. have to figure out if we can get there from here, because I'm, I'm not sure how this goes. Well, I think we can, we have to go here to the left. Yeah, but... And that, Ow. There's a lot of construction going on yeah. in these... Uh, yeah, a lot of blockades. Underpasses and overpasses yeah. and... True. That's I a good know. thing. It feels like we're well, a little bit closer. Yeah. Yeah, that's the hospital. I never noticed the Burger King next to the hospital. Yeah, well, it's not really next to the hospital. It's a small industrial thing. Oh, yeah, in front of it. Maybe if we can find a path 
Maybe, oh no, this one is closed. Is it? Oh no, that's pedestrian. Oh yeah, okay. So maybe if we can find a path here that will take us through the forest. Yeah, and otherwise, no, we no, need I to think... look at Apple Maps to see. No, 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 we, I think uh... we'll get there. Look, if we just keep following and go with this curve, we'll no, end no, up there. I'm not sure if there's an underpass to go under the freeway. Well, this guy is coming from that way, so there must be something. Ah, he was giving us friendly smiles. It's nice, perfect area for your dogs. Yeah, if you have a dog. Yeah. Yeah. I was hoping we'd see more from this uh, little lake here, but yeah, but this is nice. Now we're gonna see a whopper. It's even a better view, better sight. Look at this dog, he's so cute. He's so cute. <laughs> oh, they're nice bangs and long mustache. Yeah. Maybe we can turn right here, but... I just love how sometimes we go from clouds right over us to sun that then comes out and you see all that change in front of you, all around you, from dark to shadowy to sunny. We can give this a try. I'm not, yeah, not yeah, quite yeah, sure yeah, where yeah. it ends, but... Uh, yeah, well, at least it looks more like in that direction. Yeah, I think we're almost here. Oh, this is a hotel? Never knew that. This tower is a hotel? Yeah. It's a water tower. Oh, it's converted to a hotel. I just don't like the... I just don't like the theming on it. No, it, it's a bit uh, weird. Uh, yeah, I think it would have been better if you just kept it as a... Um, the outside as it is, as a water tower. Oh yeah, there's Burger King, you guys. We're now biking over cars, driveway. Wait, let me show some, some of that to you. Yeah, you want to film this? Yeah, just a little bit. It's like a, a racetrack. Yeah, stay on that end, because here you have the um, road signs. Yeah, I, I got some of it. The burgers are calling us. Yeah. We're being... You hear them? I hear them. It's me. A nice crispy Whopper. Come find me. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, there's also KFC. Man, I haven't had KFC in almost 15 years. Wow. 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 I love KFC. But... Let's see if we can cross this road. That's it. Oh, yeah, we can. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, I love KFC. No. No? I don't know, maybe I'll, maybe I'll do a KFC and you do. It's all chicken. I mean, how different can it be? Yes. Mmm, I'm smelling all kind of smells. I'm yum. Yum, yum, give me some. Mm. 
Now, if we were at Disney, we'd do a mobile order, and by the time we're there, it will be done, ready for us. All right, so let us find a place where we can, maybe here, Mike? Okay, yeah, I'm going to. Here? Maybe further? That's a nice and in-between spot between KFC and Burger King. Is it even open? Is Burger King even open? Huh? Is it even? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Are you going in with me or waiting no. here? No. Wait. All right. Oh. Are the mics on? Um. Die voor mij wel volgens mij. Zie je een uitslag? Wait, 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 wait. Oké. Ja? Yes. Oké. So, the mics are on. It's on like Donkey Kong. Well, what? Yeah, I'm here. Okay. We're up and running, we're online, we're on air. So that was a little, little break. <laughs> little break with big calories. It was worth it. It was so good. Very big. Very big calories. <laughs> Let good. me quickly double check to see. Take your time. No, we need to go that road. Yeah? Yeah. Well, that road? The other side. Okay. No. We need to go that way. So this is where we were. You got a couple of them next to each other. I think three. You got KFC, Burger King, and the third one, I don't know what that is. But yeah, it's all fast food. Oh no, his his car died on him. Yeah, saw it. Yeah. I was about to ask if we could help, but then again, what do we know about cars? We don't even have a driving license, but then the other guy stopped, so he shall be good. He he should be alright. I never know the right angle for this, but I think this is good as it is right now. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, that was a nice stop. Yeah. Treat, treat ourselves. Yes. Really nice, friendly staff. They work hard. Okay, go to the left here. Yeah. To the left, to the left. Everybody goes to the left. And then under the bridge? No. Oh, I get it. Yeah, this is 
This is the this is the way from the hospital to the city center. Yeah, but I I, I should have calculated a different route now. So let's okay. see where it will take us. Okay. Yeah. So guys, um, if you happen to be in Holland in Amsterdam, and like I said, God forbid, and let's hope you will never need it. But let's just say for a reason, if you need to find out how to bike from the city center to the hospital. We did that in a video. Um, you know, sometimes you want to visit someone. And sometimes the cost can be in the way. It all smells like barbecue and you know, meat, meat. Yeah, a lot. A lot of meat being roasted. That smell, it's nice. Ah, makes you hungry, makes you wanna inhale more food. Like Kirby. Like Kirby, yeah. Well, we did, we did a little bit of inhaling ourselves just now. For example, those Burger King chili cheese nuggets, man. Yeah, they're good. We pop them like popcorn. They're good. That cheese oozes out the minute you bite in it. Okay, I changed the route, but I don't think it's... Uh, <laughs> it's picking it up. No, it's, it's picking it up. It's okay. It's okay. Well, not really, but... What can you do about it? Nothing. But maybe it's a good reason to uh, end the video here. Not oh, no, 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 no. It's no? sending us to the right, so... Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. It's going to be a, a video of almost two hours, so that's okay. That's okay. Okay, so we're turning right here. Yeah. Now you guys feel like you're here with us. Oh, it's green. Just relax on your sofa. Grab some churros. <laughs> grab some popcorn and snacks and just... Grab some churros. Just imagine yourself biking with us. Yeah, because everyone has churros on the way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> I can't get uh, Carlos Whisper out of my head. We recently saw the Wham documentary about George Michael and Wham, the band that he started in. Really nice, really sweet documentary. Okay, we're turning left here. About his life. So sad. It's unclear who needs to stop. No, we need to stop. Yeah, we're on the right. Sometimes you forget that even pedestrians and bikers have limited rights in Amsterdam, but we like to think that we don't. The locals here, but... Okay, turn left here. <clears throat> And turn right again here. This is Amsterdam southeast. For those of you that wonder, it's Amsterdam southeast. Southeast, yeah. And this 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 park is called the back of the dog. Look, this is the back side of my office building. The back side of your office? Yeah. This is my oh. oh, well now you guys seen where Mike works. Now don't don't be creepy and go wait in the bushes on him. Ow! I'm 
sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's deserted here. Normally yeah, it isn't. This is a, just the metro station for the um, offices here. Yeah, but normally there's a lot of people. No. No? It's it's Saturday, so the office. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. This is mainly an office uh, terrain area. area. Yeah. So if today was a working day, it will be buzzing here because it's yeah. 10 past 12. Look, you see all kind of food trucks just park here closed I guess they work only during the week right. these are the mega flats they put in in the 60s and 70s and they've now decided to break them up some of them they turn it left here I smell Indian slash Suriname food <coughs> Ten kilometers to the central station. Still ten? Yeah. Okay. Felt like we were more closer to it. No. Look at this art. It's kind of cute. Make life work together. Yes, that's one that's song. That's my old office building. That is his old, yeah, the one behind these trees that looks like a cartoon uh, building. They call it the Sand Castle. The Sand Castle, it looks but, like Doctor Who. But it's now been converted into apartments. It's really cute. That's a, a yeah. beautiful office. It is. It has, it has like this cartoony shape. Yeah, there's no right angles. Yeah, there it is. Yeah, this used to be your office building. Yeah. And now it's converted into apartments. The main entrance. Building. I smell a lot of food. A lot of curry, maybe. Asian, Indian food, African food. It's really a mix of everything in it. Smell all of it. Say. So Aero say is almost like a franchise. It's a high school with different directions.
and once you finish this you can actually just you know start your work your career that's what i love about that it's not theoretic uh, it's not theory it's really it's more like when you get your diploma you can start your working career That's actually how I started working for the government. It's almost straight line. <clears throat> yeah, it is. Yeah, it's nice to see different aspects of Amsterdam. So this is really the suburbs. Look at that girl in her 90s, 90s themed outfit, love it. The shirt, the pants, the headphones, all 90s. Saved by the bell vibe. Yeah. the gym boys man I think last time me and Mike were in a bus on a bus is maybe what three years three years ago well, Disney World. Disney World. Oh. Yeah. Ah, oh. we're oh, going oh. down, oh. up, down, oh. up. Oh, that was nice. That was nice. Oh, look for a big duck. That's a goose. It's a goose. Yeah, there's something wrong with the feathers. They were sticking out, like in a weird fashion. A young goose. There we go again, uh, down, uh, up, up, down, up, so smooth. You can feel the suspension of the back. Yeah. Can't you? I wasn't, I wasn't paying attention. Oh. I was just enjoying the up and down. Oh, well. Upsy downsies. Upsy downsies. Wow, they have some beautiful art here. I it's wouldn't like want to cycle here in uh, at night. <laughs> at night. No, I wouldn't either. <laughs> okay, so we go to the left and then to the right again. Yeah. No, I wouldn't either. To the left or the right? To the right. Whoa. I saw that. to go to the left here to the left yeah. 
Yes, nobody. Nobody knows. Wow, that woman's been with us. Yeah. For a long time. I saw her when we turned the corner. Yeah. That's funny. Everybody with their umbrellas on the balcony. Yeah. That's cute. It's a nice neighborhood. This is actually Demon. Demon? Demon. I almost... Almost bought a home here. But... Then I didn't. Demon. So not like demon as in English. That's not it. Demon. Wow, look how dark it got here. Yeah. Demon. Just like a demon. A good colleague of mine lived here. Maybe she still does. She was really sweet. Now it's six kilometers to the central station. Can you believe it? But we're gonna stop at home and drop off the batteries. <laughs> There's a kid swinging on their, own, their balcony and his grandma looking at him. That's really sweet. It's dangerous. Uh, yeah, but then he, he swings really low. And he's not swinging toward the uh, Whoa, street. Look, look. Whoa. He's not swinging toward the street. Wow, some people have really tropical plants. In the tropical storm. In the tropical storm of... Okay. <laughs> Go to the left here. Tropical plants, honestly, and flowers. They, they, they manage to keep life in this weather, in the Dutch weather on the balcony. Whoa, look how dark it is. Keep biking to the light, Mike. Keep biking toward the light. Yes, it worked. Good. Whoa. Man, little bumps here. We're spoiled in Holland because usually the, the pathways are perfect. Well then, when they're not, we're not talking about huge uh, uh, potholes or anything. But then to us, they seem like very inconvenient. Oh, looks like thunder hit here. Yeah. Look at that tree. Yeah, the branch just. That's just from off. the storm folly. From the tropical storm. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to make some people really mad who don't like that term. The tropical storm. Ah, that guy was smiling, really friendly to Mike. Oh, I didn't see him. Actually, he was laughing at me, I think. He was laughing? Why would he be laughing? Because I'm wearing a uh, headset. One of those Janet Jackson's Okay, so headsets. How do we do this? Uh, yeah. Follow oh. the yellow brick road. Follow, follow, follow. Oh, we should have ended up there. Well. Ah, uh, well. Be careful here. The Wenkebach Weg. Wenkebach Weg. It's one of the most Dutch sounding street names. 
Wenkebach weg. Wenkebach weg. So I, I sometimes hear some Americans say, oh, ech, it's such a hard sound to make. But then you also hear Americans saying, ach, when something bothers you guys, you roll your eyes and you say, ach. So it shouldn't be like completely alien sound to you. Love that more buildings, Rochdale. 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 So this is a little bit dangerous. We have pedestrians, we have cars, we have bikes. Yeah, it's a bit uh, all on the same road. Not really it's a getting bit this. Unclear. Yeah. Oh, it looks like it's picking up my yeah, wind. It's picking up. I'm Starting getting dust in my eyes. Me too. Dust gets in your eyes. Oh, this is a nice route. Yeah, it is. I've never been here before. Yeah, it's a nice neighborhood. It's so nice that it could have been Mr. Rogers' neighborhood. This is the Amstel station. We're very close to the uh, garden center. To the? Garden center. Oh. Yeah, I can't wait till next year to go and pick some flowers and just bring them home on our bikes. Because recently we've been ordering flowers online. And not often, but sometimes you have a hit and miss in between. A hit or miss in between. And because they come all the way from Germany, I think it was, it's not really easy to go complain or... No. So you just have to accept it. It's something I can't do. Look, and this is the same route we've been on previously. Yeah, but it's so nice. I want to do it twice. Yeah, or thrice. Or thrice. <laughs> this route is so nice. So I'm seeing thrice. You guys know what reference that is? Ow! We're still big, big lovers of the gold girls. At least I am, and I think Mike is too. I am too. Yeah. <clears throat> the gold girl's humor will never be outdated for me. Always, they always get me laughing. Wow, I'm smelling pot. That cute dog. That dog was so happy. Happy as a puppy. Yeah, it's starting to change now. Yeah, it's starting to change. So we're exactly on time yeah, to go I think back so in. Too. Yeah. But remember, it's not tropical. <laughs> it's just, it isn't. It's just wind, summer wind. Let's get tropical, tropical. Wasn't that one of Madonna's songs? Let's get physical from Olivia Newton John. Oh, <coughs> that's what it was. Okay. This is such a nice 
nice piece to bike through. Do, 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 do. <laughs> that dog. Dogs love to be on bike rides. Everybody's staying away from that guy. He's yeah. carrying long sticks. Yeah. And instead of focusing on the road, he's focusing on that girl with nice bosom. With the ample bosom. With the ample bosom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, focus, man, focus. You're gonna poke somebody's eye out. Yeah, this is always nice to bike through. I don't know, it's such a smooth piece, smooth street to bike through. Yeah, but a lot of people. Yeah, it is, it is. It's like a bottleneck. Brings a lot of bikers here together, so. Okay. I think I need to stop for a moment. Yeah? Yeah. Stop here. No. Over here. I have something in my eye. Yeah? Yeah. Mike is okay. Yeah, I didn't wear my sunglasses. And with that uh, last uh, big gush. Yeah. No, I got you. I get you. Sand. Yeah, I've been getting my contact. <laughs> I had, uh, I've been getting a lot of dust in my eyes too. And I was wondering because I'm wearing my glasses, but somehow it doesn't help. Yeah, it, it, it deflects the, the most of it, but not all. That's funny. So all of those barkers in front of us, they all agreed to come to that cafe. Yeah. That is the place to be. It's the place to be, yeah. It's on a nice corner, so you can watch people. I think so. Nice place to watch people. People watching is actually a thing, guys. And one even may dare to call it a hobby. go again whoop whoop you see the kids enjoying it yeah that's that's sweet By the way, guys, they're looking for staff at the uh, Amstel Hotel, which is one of the best hotels, like we told you in previous videos. I saw they have some... They put out job application. Be interesting. You're going to be serving royals. Yeah. Or like the Maleficent said, nobilities 
royalties and a third group I forgot Wow, there's even a car behind us. I thought this was just a bike pathway. No, not this one, obviously, but... This is always a tricky spot. Yeah. So if you this guys ever uh... end up here, really be careful because there is traffic from all kind of corners. Okay, so today is easy, but today usually... Today is easy. Today is easy. Usually it's really tricky. Yeah. Amsterdam is a beautiful city. Yeah, what makes Amsterdam so beautiful is it's it's not the same thing as what makes New York New York or Paris Paris. Amsterdam has its own unique thing that makes them beautiful. The canals. Canals and just the whole thing. So when I say beautiful, it's not the same definition as you guys may have of New York skyscrapers and all that. No. It's completely different charm. That's what makes it different and special. I smell what smells like fish cookies. Yeah, it's a strange smell yeah. over here. Like fish cookies, I know if you call them fish cookies. Mommy used to make fish us... cookies. You know, when we were kids, she, she used to make us burgers made of sardines. She would debone and, you know, and spice up. Yeah. So we're now in front of uh, Rembrandt's home. That's been. You want to go uh, straight ahead? Oh, doesn't matter. And we then, can um, go to the over the Rechtbaumstraat. Yeah, but we need to make a stop at home first. That's okay. So, so yeah, so all these windows that you see here on the left, red and green windows, 
that is Rembrandt's home. That is, that's his home that he bought after he started to make some money. Those girls were naughty, they were flirting. So go right here. Go to the right. And then to the left. Mm -hmm. To the right. There is this Armenian church here and every Sunday morning when they have mass sometimes we might happen to be here on the exact time when they start to sing and it's always beautiful. Here. Yeah, let's see it right on the left with the white entrance. 1714. From 1740? 14. So yeah. <laughs> I smell only pot. Yeah. <laughs> there is this smell of pot in the air, like all around us. Tourists are funny. You guys come here only for pot. <laughs> it is so cold and uh... yeah. Airbnb. Yeah, it's on. Uh, oh, that goes right through. No, no yay for us. No, of the yay is all the cabs. Of course not. Material girls, they just want guys with cars. <laughs> 